my tripod uh, because I'm filming on my phone because I didn't want to get out my camera and I don't know where my tripod is and I don't know where my other box light is. It's a whole mess, but anyway, this is the best that we're going to attempt to do. Uh, the lighting is trash, so uh, I'm sorry. Um, anyway, so I'm getting ready for an interview. Quit my other job, which was at a local Mexican restaurant because of harassment issues. Yeah. Harassment issues by a 35-year-old uh, woman. The interview is at 3. It's currently 12.30ish. Uh, but uh, I'm going to leave here like 1-something so I can make sure that I'm early and, you know, that everything is good. Granted, it's in a whole different city than where I live because I live in a really small town. So this is like one of the closest cities that there is, and it's 30 minutes away. It's where my boyfriend lives, so I go there all the time, so I know my way around it. Fairly easy, plus most of my family lives there also, so yeah. It's quite obvious that I haven't been posting a lot. It's quite obvious. Reason being is, I don't have a reason. I just, I kind of, I kind of just fell out of it and I just, didn't really want to so starting now I'm going to be doing the ones like I'm going to be doing stuff that I like to do and I'm going to be filming when I feel like it and when I am in the mood to and when I'm you know happy to film so yeah I'm using the milk blur stick as my primer I use the Anastasia dip brow for my eyebrows and now I'm using the Too Faced Born This Way foundation in the shade, what shade are you? Pearl. So, yes. Also, I fell into my cabinet, which is right there, and my NARS uh, foundation broke. Good thing it was like almost out though. So I, I guess it's not too, too bad, but I was so upset that it broke because that's one of my favorite foundations of all time. And that is what I wear to school. That's, you know, my all time favorite foundation. So I guess I'm gonna have to uh, buy another one, which I don't really want to buy another one because uh, I attempted to fix the lighting with my phone. I don't know if it worked. Did it work? Kind of sort of. I look like a ghost from your guys' angle. <laughs> it looks so weird from your guys' angle. But anyway, a little life update. Uh, I haven't told you guys this, I don't think, but I've been in a serious relationship for almost a year. It'll be a year. It'll be a year in a week, I believe. August 12th. Uh, so... Yeah, it's, it's crazy. I never would have thought that that would happen to me, but it did. Like, as soon as I moved here, though, like, we got into a, a relationship, well, maybe, like, a month or two after I moved here. But we've been going strong ever since. Uh, we did break up in, like, March, but then we got back together in March because of a bunch of issues, but now we're going great. I mean... I'm gonna marry this man, so. I'm using the RCMA No Color Powder. Do y'all remember when this was like the biggest hype ever? Sheesh, that was such a long time ago. I remember when this was the biggest hype. Anyway, so we're using the RCMA No Color Powder. I haven't used this in forever. Like, it's been a long time since I've used this powder and it's just been sitting on my makeup thingy magic bob it's just been sitting there for ages also if you guys hear something my rabbit is down here just chilling uh yes that's also new and i didn't tell you guys i have a rabbit his name is indy he hates being picked up but he loves food he loves me and he loves my boyfriend his name's tucker by the way if you guys follow me on instagram you guys would know who my boyfriend is oh and my tiktok i mean i've been obsessed with tiktok lately you guys i like i love tiktok that's all that i watch like youtube nope i don't watch youtube barely i mean i do occasionally but it's the tiktok because i mean it's just so damn funny it's just so funny so about the rona that is 
Wow. School is starting to, in two weeks, I think. It's in two weeks, and uh, it was supposed to start tomorrow, but you know what happened? A school board member got Rona, so they're, like, delaying it. So if someone got the Rona and you're delaying it, why are we even going back to begin with? I don't know. We're going back, um, which is nuts. So you guys will be getting a get ready to be first day of school. I love those videos. I have been watching those videos when I'm not watching TikToks. I have been watching those videos because it's one of my favorite videos to get me back in the mood of you know going back to school. It's one of my favorites. I'm using the Too Faced chocolate Soleil bronzer in the mini size. I've never gotten the full size of this. I've just always had this one because my mom's friend gave it to me. So I've always had this one. It smells very good. It's probably expired, but it's still one of my favorite bronzers in the world. I'm gonna use the Anastasia Modern Renaissance. Haven't used this bad boy in forever. So I'm just gonna set the eyelid with Tempera. It's that shade right there. Anyway. So. I'm just rambling because I have so much to talk to you guys about. Like, I have so much. Because I haven't talked to you guys in forever. But I hope you guys are all doing good. I'm doing pretty good myself. I mean, I've been pretty broke ever since I quit my job. But I had to for my mental health. And at the same time, I was getting treated like garbage. At first, I wasn't. At first, it was a great job and I really enjoyed it. But then it started going all downhill. I was scheduled a lot because we didn't have many servers. But what I did was I used Golden Ochre and Raw Sienna, which is these two mixed into the crease. And then I used Primavera and Vermeer on the lid. Boop. You guys can't see it at all. I'll do it like close up for you guys so you guys can see. I want to make a really good impression. So I want to look like a bad so i'll probably put on falsies i don't put on falsies until it's closer to time to leave because i don't want them to like come off i guess i don't i mean i know they won't come off but like you know what I mean? benefit dallas blush i've had this blush forever this is the tatcha satin skin mist love this i have um combo skin like i get oily in the t-zone dry in the rest but this love it so if i can max soft and gentle we want to get that glow. Oh, I know you guys see that. I know you guys see it because I see it. I'm going to curl the lashes. This is just a lash curler from the dollar store. I like dollar store lash curlers, honestly. They're really good. I mean, I've never had a bad eyelash curler. It's like, I take that back. I have had a bad eyelash curler because it like, didn't grasp the lashes that you could like feel. The Maybelline Lash Sensational uh, Luscious Full Fan Effect Mascara. But this is the one that goes with the, oh, the Colossal, because I don't like the wand that goes with this mascara. I don't like it at all. I just feel like it, you know, doesn't do good for my lashes, and it kind of makes them all stick together and doesn't give what I want my lashes to do. Because I like mine to be, like, volume and, like, out like that, you know? But it just makes it, like, stick together. So this is what the makeup looks like before the lashes still debating on if i want to put on lashes i mean i look i think i look pretty cute if i do this on myself do you guys want to see my bunny hold on let me find my bunny indy hi baby that's indy he's a very nice bunny and i love him with all my heart I'm debating on putting like what kind of lashes to put on so oh i had a burp anyway uh i'm gonna use i think the maryland's uh, by the Shop Masse brand. Um, they're one of my favorite pair of lashes. I mean, they're a dollar and they're really cheap. And honestly, they're really cute. So I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put on the Maryland's. There's lashes on the pack that I think are Maryland's. I use the Kiss Strip Lash Adhesive. So I, I probably need to get a new one because it's all nasty. Um, anyway, so why am I going overboard with lashes, you might ask? Because I want to make a good impression. I really do want to make a good impression. And this, the job that I'm applying for, it's it, it's a retail position. I mean, it's nothing fancy. This is my first time in retail if I do get, you know, like the job. And I really, 
I really want to work retail. Like I, I'm done with the food industry. I don't want to work in the food industry because honestly, I don't like it. It is so bleh, and just so uh, that's, you know, that's the only way that I can describe it. Gosh, I hate applying false either. Okay, so I applied the lashes. This is what they look like. I mean, I'm not, I think I'm looking pretty darn good. But for the inner corner, if you can see them, I think I'm going to put like some black liner on it. So it'll like blend Update. it. I couldn't find any black eyeliner because I think I got rid of it because it was like way too old. So I just need some black eyeshadow in the inner corner. That lash right there, if you can see it, it's really annoying me. It's really annoying me. But I think, you know, it's okay. You know, it's all right. It's time for hair. So I put it up in a bun so it could somewhat dry, somewhat not, but it's kind of still wet and it looks bad. <laughs> trying to give it a little bit of volume towards the top because it looks really flat. This is an old toothbrush that I do for my hair because I have really bad baby hairs. The toothbrush it actually kind of like works to make it like less frizzy. Kind of works. Up close of everything as well because like the lighting is really really bad so here's like the up close look at the baby look at it where my closet terrible lighting i know um i'm gonna do like a back to school haul i think i mean if you guys want to see that i will but i don't know i'm thinking about wearing what i wore to my last interview just like this like really pretty pretty blue skirt shirt oh, and then this skirt or like this top like black bralettes and like ooh, I really want to wear this this skirt. I wear this. Okay, so it took out forever for me to pick out an outfit, honestly, because I wasn't liking how my body was looking in all of them. So I'm gonna show you the outfit uh right now. So this is what it looks like. Full body. So this is what it looks like from the front. I look frumpy in the front, but you know. But but from the side, what it looks like. I'll probably wear some brown boots, I'm thinking. But that's what it looks like. These are the shoes that I'm wearing. Uh, they're just black boot heels. So I'm currently waiting to skedaddle, skadoodle out of my house. For my interview, I'll keep you guys posted of how the interview goes. I'm really nervous because I have anxiety. Um, but I'll keep you guys posted and I'll tell you guys what happens. Okay, guys, so I am currently here. It's 2.17. My interview is at 3. Um, I'm very early, so I'm just going to sit here and watch TikToks. And to pass by the time, I'll let you guys know how it goes. So, cross your fingers. Cross your fingers. I'm not right. Anyway, uh, so my interview went well, and I got the job. So, I'm so excited, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I'm very excited to be posting some more, and yeah, see you guys later.